I'm Anil Kumar. Welcome to my series on angles between lines. Here is question number three. Given the points A, B, and C, find angle between A, B, and B, C. What do you conclude from the result? Well, angle between two lines, the formula which we have learned is tan theta equals to m2 minus m1 over 1 plus m1 m2, correct? Now, m1 and m2 are slopes of two different lines. In this case, the lines are a, b, and b, c, b being a common point, right? Now, let me just sketch them here on the side, just to give you an idea. So the points here are 1 minus 2, so somewhere here, right? 3, 0. So 3, 0 means on the x-axis, somewhere here, right? Okay. And then 3, minus 4. So 3 minus 4 will be down. So these are my points. We need to find the angle between. So this is the point A, right? B is here and C is this point. So we need to find the angle between A to B and B to C. So we basically need to find this angle theta. Right. So that is the situation. So first we'll find the slope of each, right? So what is slope of A to B? Using the formula, y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. A to B, the points of our interest are these two, right? So 0 minus minus 2, that is plus 2, and 3 minus 1. So that gives you 2 over 2, and the slope is 1, right? Okay, now let's consider the second point, which is second set of points, which is B, B to C, right? Okay, so the slope for B to C is minus 4 minus 0 divided by 3 minus 3. Now, sorry, 3 minus 3. Now, 3 minus 3 is 0, right? So that is undefined. Now this is a very typical case. Now what is important to understand here is that when we are talking about the formula, in this case, if the slope is undefined, we cannot use the formula, right? So now, now the formula is not valid. because the value of m2 is undefined. So you cannot use the value. Do you see that? Now in such cases, what do you do? So we say this is a special case, correct? With undefined slopes. Now undefined means a vertical line. Clear? So that means this line which we are talking about, BC, is actually a vertical line. Right? So this is undefined slope. It's a vertical line. Clear? But knowing the slope of this, which is 1, we can actually find the angle which AB makes with the x-axis, correct? And that is 90 degrees. This angle is 90 degrees, correct? So from here, 90 minus alpha can give us the value. Is that clear to you? So in thus, this case, what do we do? We know slope is tan theta. So we'll say tan of alpha, the angle which the line makes with the x-axis, is equal to 1. So that gives you that alpha equals to 45 degrees, right? So tan of 45 degrees is 1. So we know this angle is 45 degrees. So what is the angle between the lines? That is what we need to figure out, correct? So we know that the angle is 45 degrees, which is this angle, correct? These two are equal, 45 degrees. 
since it is a vertical line, so the angle AOC, A, let me call this as ABC. So angle ABC is basically equal to 90 degrees minus 45 degrees, which is 45 degrees. So whenever you have undefined slope, in that case, you have to use your logic and then find out the answer. You get the idea, right? So that is how you're going to find the angle 90 minus the angle itself of first line. Okay, so 90 minus. So that is how you're going to figure it out. So I hope that makes sense. So the answer for us is that angle between AB and BC is and BC is 45 degrees. Is that clear to you, right? So whenever you have undefined lines, that means it's a vertical line, making 90 degrees angle with the positive x-axis. So 90 minus the angle of the first line gives you the slope. So this is a special case, perfect. So in special case, the answer is angle between lines equals to 90 degrees minus alpha, right? Where alpha is angle of one of those lines, which is not vertical, right? So that is how we are going to figure this out. So I hope that helps. So this exception is very important to understand. Feel free to write your comment, share your views, and if you like and subscribe to my videos, that'd be great. Thanks for watching and all the best.